folks, I'm glad you're here. Thank you very much for joining me. I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. Thank you. If you have any comments or thoughts about this earthquake that happened in Arkansas, a magnitude 2.9, please put it down below. Did you feel this earthquake? This earthquake occurred at 6.15 a.m. today, and 33 people said they did feel it. USGS gave an intensity level of 4, so they might be upgrading it. Intensity level 4 means that most people said it was probably like a magnitude 3. That's why I'm saying they'll probably upgrade it. There's no guarantee. But intensity level 4 means it was felt indoors by many, outdoors by a few. At night, some may have woken up. Dishes, windows, doors were rocking and automobiles rocked noticeably. Yes, we'll see if they change the magnitude from a 2.9, maybe to a three in a week or two weeks down the road. This earthquake occurred in the New Mad Rid seismic zone and also the Mississippi embayment. The Mississippi embayment is a physiological or physiographical feature in the south central United States, part of the Mississippi alluvial plain, it is essentially a northward continuation of the fluctual sediments of the Mississippi River Delta uh, to its confluence with the Ohio River and all the way up to Cairo, Illinois. So in layman's term, terms, this is all fill. This is all sediment that has been deposited through the eons. And as you know, to those of you that follow me, this area was originally a rift that was going to divide up the United States. And that rift extended all the way down to the Gulf of Mexico and is now all filled in with sediment. Earthquakes and sediment, um, what the effects are is that the earthquake is felt over a much larger area than say if it was on bedrock or closer to uh, rock. So we got some what greenhouses it looks like here and we got some homes. So they are probably the ones that reported it and it must have been strong enough for them to send in 33 people to send in reports to USGS did you feel an earthquake. I would like to know if you have damage. Maybe some cracks in your plaster walls things like that, or in your foundation. Have you taken a look at your driveways or sidewalks? This earthquake was felt as far as Waverly, intensity level 2. And here's, let me move in closer to where the earthquake occurred. Let's see, Bald Knob, intensity level 4. Three reports from there. I'm surprised they even put it there. Let's see, what else do we got? Over here is Arlington. Intensity level 3, one report from there. And then Jacksonville. Intensity level 2, one report from there. So Waverly is 428 kilometers from where the epicenter happened. So that would be 265 miles intensity level two meaning they were probably resting laying on a bed well they probably hadn't gotten up yet seeing how it was 6 15 a.m in the morning felt like persons who had been laying down especially on the upper floors delicate suspended objects may be swinging even though they said it probably felt like a magnitude two to them we also have another report from ash flat which is 82 kilometers now that would be north, intensity level 2. So I think that's about 51 miles north. So yeah, it's interesting that this person all the way over here by Waverly uh, felt it with an intensity level 2. I'm sure there's a lot more people that did feel this earthquake and didn't send in reports to USGS. So I would like to know how long did it last? What did the motion feel like? Did you have any vertigo or was there any indication from your pets uh, that something was coming, something was odd? 
And this is the second one today for the new Mad Red Seismic Zone. Yeah, interesting. Please put those comments down below. I really enjoy reading them. Those in our community like reading them too. Thank you for watching. Please like. Make sure you're subscribed. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.